what's up everyone welcome to my channel in this video i'll show you how to add a namecheap custom domain name or a domain name that you uh, like bought on namecheap to your canva build website so as you know canva is a great tool that you can use to design virtually anything from like presentations to uh, logos to posters to flyers you name it and you can also use it to build websites and in this video i'll show you if you built already built a website how to add a custom domain name that you bought from namecheap to this website however you must note that in order to do so and add a custom domain name you need to be on the pro plan on canva so you cannot do it on the free plan you can design of course and uh, create your website and like uh, maybe edit a website template and create your website however you won't be able to publish it if you are on the free plan so uh, that's one thing to note that you have to be on the pro plan so first i'll take you through the steps on how to uh, create or edit a website on canva i won't go deeply into the uh, like uh, how to create or edit the website itself or the steps or techniques you uh, want to use to edit your website i'll focus more on adding the domain name to it so here in the canva i've opened my canva uh, website or my i'm signed into my canva account and here in the search bar you want to search for website to view the website templates that are available and here it'll show you many templates that you can use to uh, edit and build your website i just want to use a basic one okay let's say i want to use this template so click on it it'll show up here and it'll show you uh, like uh, similar templates that you might want to use if you decide to customize this template or use this template just click on customize this template it'll open the editor in a new tab and here it is the template is now open now you can edit it as you uh, do with any other canva design like for example a text uh, element you can like uh, click or double click to highlight it to highlight the text or just click and drag to highlight it and you can uh, simply change the text so let's say test website for example here and you can also edit like the color the size uh, make it bold italic edit the alignment uh, add effects animated edit the transparency and so much more so let's say for example we want to make it uh, blue here and make it bold italic and underlined and you can even add a link to any uh, text element so that uh, once uh, the visitor clicks on it it'll open like a page or lead them to another website or whatever you want to do and you can also edit the button design here click on it you can uh, edit the uh, border style and the border uh, weight and the border color and everything and make the text color sorry and text size and make it bold italic and so on and here you can edit the border color so if we want it like a light blue and make the text for example like uh, a pinkish or violet color you can do that and if we click on the photo itself or the background we can like uh, edit the image click on edit image right here we okay let's click this let's close this uh, we can adjust the brightness the contrast and so on or uh, we can add different styles we can add shadow we can we have some tools that we can use and we can even like uh, edit the transparency to make it more or less transparent we can delete it we can animate it we can crop it and we can do anything with it and if we want to edit elements so let's say we want to edit like an icon right here we can go to elements so here let's search for example if you want like an add an icon of like flower so let's type in flower okay and then in the graphics let's say i uh, want to see all and i like this one just drag it and drop it here and we can rotate it okay we can resize it we can edit the uh, like layering so if we can if we want to uh, like put it here behind the text or in front and so on and we can also edit the animation transparency and so on so you can basically edit every element or add new elements to your website now let's get to the process of adding the custom domain name so once you finish all the editing on the style and the look of your website click here on publish website and here it'll notice that the designing is locked so you cannot edit or add any design or 
edit the looks of your website if you want to go back to editing it you just go click on edit design right here to go back to the editor you can just scroll down and see how it looks like and you want to check here resize on mobile so that it uh, like resizes the photos and the text and the elements to look better on or to fit a mobile phone screen so here you have three options for a domain you can get a free domain that is generated by canva which will be something like uh, your website name dot canva dot com or something like that something like a basic uh, generic uh, free domain name that is generated and you have the option to purchase a new domain name from within canva or if you already purchased a domain you can go ahead and link it so use my existing domain that's what we are going to do here so click on use existing domain click continue and here you want to paste or add your uh, domain name so I'll go to Namecheap here and then uh, I'll go to my account click on dashboard and as you can see here I have a domain name that I purchased that's how to simple dot online I'll just copy it okay and then paste it right here okay paste now click on continue and now you want to add these txt records into your dns settings of your uh, namecheap website so go back to uh, namecheap and then next to your like website or uh, domain name click on manage it'll open up the domain name page you want to click here on advanced dns and in here you want to add records so here click on add new record and let's go back to confirm yep it's a txt record okay now let's scroll down a bit as you can see here there is a txt record click on it and here you want to add this uh, this one here you want you have like uh, the name or the host or the alias that's the value that you want to add so click on copy it copies the value or you can simply highlight it and copy it and then here in the host paste it and now we have a value so for the value here the value is this uh, like value here you can highlight it to select it or which is easier click on copy to copy it and then paste it right here okay and now click on this like checkbox icon or like uh, this uh, green icon to save changes okay and once your changes are now saved go back to canva and click on txt record added okay and now you want to add a new record that's an a record so here go back to the uh, dns settings add a new record in the record type it's an a record okay for the host or the name or the alias that's at the at sign copy it and then paste it right here and then for the value or the ip address copy this value and then paste it here and then also click on save changes or you can click on save all changes and now the two values are added go back to canva and now you finally need to add a new or another a record okay so a record let's go back to uh, name cheap add a new record a record okay copy the host that's www paste it here and then for the value copy it and then also paste it right here and then you can click on save all changes all or save changes so now we added these uh, three values go back to canva and now click on a record added and once you added all these uh, three records click on connect domain and you have uh, some uh, final changes so here that's how or that's uh, the name or the or the text that will appear next to your uh, web page so for example if we type in test so that's how your website or your url will, be, will appear so how to simple dot online slash test so uh, let's leave it as it is and here the name of your website that will appear in the tabs here click on edit so let's enter my test website for example that's how it look you can add a page description that will like show up in the search results and here you have advanced settings you can uh, you of course you want to check search engine visibility is enabled and link preview is enabled and now you want to click on publish now it'll prepare your design to publish 
and connect like link your uh, domain name that you bought on name name cheap to your canva website and now here it is uh, like finally done and it uh, it tells you that you uh, might have to wait up to 72 hours to the verification and the processing are completed and your uh, website will go live so that's how easy it is to uh, add a domain name from namecheap to your canva website